Defending national champion Florida is a near-unanimous number one in the Associated Press preseason college football poll. In the history of the AP poll, there's never been a unanimous choice to start the season. The Gators almost became the first. Florida is as close as it's ever been. Uh, the Gators received 58 of 60 first place votes. That percentage is the highest ever in the history of the preseason poll, which dates back four decades. Leading the Gators is 2007 Heisman Trophy winner Tim Tebow, who accounted for 42 touchdowns last season. Russo said even if the left-handed quarterback had turned pro, Florida still might have been voted the preseason number one. There was some question whether Tebow was going to go to the NFL after last season. He was a junior and he had had a great season and there was some NFL talk. If Tebow had jumped to the NFL, it's very likely Florida could have been number one anyway. Um, it would have been far more up in the air, though. Not only do the Gators have a dangerous offensive threat in Tebow, all 11 defensive starters return from last season's national championship team, right behind Florida in the preseason poll of the Texas Longhorns. Well, Texas comes in at number two in the preseason poll, led by Colt McCoy, who was the Heisman runner-up last year. In many ways, he's got a lot of Tim Tebow in him. McCoy's a very good runner, an excellent and accurate passer. He set an NCAA record last year with 77% completions. Starting the new season ranked third is Oklahoma. The Sooners are led by last year's Heisman Trophy winner, quarterback Sam Bradford. Oklahoma scored 52 or more points in nine games last season. Uh, the questions for for Oklahoma will be along the offensive line. They have to replace four starters and they have to replace most of the receiving unit that played so well last season. Seven-time defending Pac-10 champion USC comes in at number four despite losing starting quarterback Mark Sanchez to the NFL and nine of 11 defensive starters. Rounding out the top five are the Crimson Tide of Alabama, winners of 12 games last season. Carlotta Bradley, The Associated Press.